Hi, it's Dwyer, gamblersadvisory.com, DwyerSportsBetting.com. You know, one of the truths in life is that things aren't always what they seem. Now, perhaps you're one of these people who believes what you hear, who believes the image being presented of the world, right? You might think that in the United States, Social Security is safe and properly funded. You might believe in the United States that we're in an economic recovery and that the fundamentals actually line up for the stock market. Okay, fine. If you're that kind of person, I can't reach you here with this video. This video is really intended for those of us who have a skeptical eye to what they hear, who openly question whether the mainstream narrative or the image being presented to us is even true. Let me offer my first exhibit to the contrary. If you go to Las Vegas and if you wander into Caesars Casino, right? It's right in the middle of the strip. Wow. It looks so good, right? Caesars Palace. Think about the name. You're walking into Caesars. You're looking around. You're thinking, this is lavish. This is luxury. This is reeks of success that's the image you watch movies like the hangover the original one before that series got a bit predictable right and the casino where they are at first is caesar's palace right caesar's palace is emblematic of las vegas right isn't vegas selling you on the idea that this is a successful party spot well, understand that Caesars Entertainment Corporation, the symbol is CZR, according to reports, has been forced into involuntary bankruptcy. The next time you're in that casino, look around. Everything is financed. Right? You cannot talk about Las Vegas without talking about debt loads right understand while you're there and they're selling you the extravagant lifestyle oh the bottle service oh the view of the strip you know the history evil Knievel jumping in front of the casino right as they're trying to convince you that they know how to operate a hotel casino the right way as they're trying to tell you that they have the answers to your questions before you ask them. Right? That they're on top of the odds in Sin City, the gambling mecca. Just understand that they don't have enough money right now to pay their creditors. Their debt has to be reorganized. Right? The gorgeous interior, the luxury, the easy laughs. They've had to borrow money to present that picture. Right? Let me offer another truth of life. Maybe the experts aren't experts. Maybe nobody is an expert right maybe these images aren't real hey i love vegas as much as the next guy but don't be fooled by the bright lights some of the gamblers there who are losing money they're no different than some of the guys gambling on the future of the casinos themselves right don't be overwhelmed or intimidated by las vegas because in some locations they themselves don't know what the hell they're doing one man's view let me hear yours 
leave your comments for me here in the comment section to this video let me point out too that if you follow Vega stocks you're gonna notice that Caesars is not the only big-time casino company in Las Vegas with huge debt that it can barely manage if it can manage it right other companies in Vegas have huge debts on the books huge right if you follow the history of the city an argument can be made that the city is built in large part on creditors taking haircuts let me hear from you leave your comments for me here online visit us at gamblersadvisory.com this idea that the casinos know what's going on and the casino always wins not only might not be true but might be demonstratively disproven by the casino's own ability, inability to pay its own bills. Thanks for stopping by.